Hello everybody, the One Red Panda here, and welcome to my brand new Let's Play for The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD. This is literally like my, one of my, like if not, it's a tie between Majora's Mask and Wind Waker on my favorite Zelda game ever. It's just like, this is literally one of my favorites, so I don't want to waste any time and let's just get started. This is the HD version, and I'm playing on the Pro Controller. So, uh, yeah, let's just start it on Qu Quest Log 3, and we need to choose our name. Let's just go with Normal Link. Alright, okay. And, uh, I I'm just gonna go with Normal Mode, because I've never tried, like, Hard Mode, and I, just for the sake of this Let's Play and for my grief, I'm not gonna... Go with hard mode this time, so we're just gonna go with normal and let's start. This is but one of the legends of which the people speak. Long ago, there existed a kingdom where a golden power lay hidden. It was a prosperous land blessed with green forests, the tall mountains, and peace. But one day, a man of great evil found the golden power and took it for himself. With his strength at his command, he spread darkness across the kingdom. But then, when all hope had died and the hour of doom seemed at hand, A young boy clothed in green appeared as if from nowhere. Wielding the blade of evil's bane, he sealed the dark one away and gave the land light. This boy, who traveled through time to save the land, was known as the Hero of Time. The boy's tale was passed down through generations until it became legend. But then, a day came when a fell wind began to blow across the kingdom. The great evil that all had thought had been forever sealed away by the hero. Once again crept forth from the depths of the earth, eager to resume its dark designs. The people believed the that the Hero of Time would again come to save them. But the Hero did not appear. Faced by an onslaught of evil, the people could do nothing but appeal appease yielded to the gods. In their last hour, as Doom drew nigh, they left their future in the hands of fate. What became of that kingdom? None remain who know. The memory of the kingdom vanished, but its legend survived on the wind's breath. On a certain island, it became customary to guard boys in green when they, when they became of age. Clothed in the green field of fields, they aspired to find heroic blades and cast down evil. The elders wished only for the youths to know the courage like the hero of legends. Here we are at Outset Island. Look at that gorgeous HD graphics.
Big brother! Big brother! Big brother! I knew you'd be here! Hee <laughs> hee, <laughs> this is my favorite spot to gaze out at the sea. When I play the, the goals, I call it Ar Errol's Lookout. So, do you remember what day it is today? You still have to sleep, aren't you? Did you forget? Big Brother, it's your birthday! Oh my gosh, it is? That's why Grandma has been waiting for you to come back to the house. She's been waiting for a while now. It's a good thing I came to find you. You should probably go home and see what Grandma wants, don't you think? Alright, and now we are finally starting. So, I guess the first thing to do is to climb down the ladder and drop. And move the control stick forward so you don't have... You actually don't get hurt once you land on your head, but just to be safe. So yeah, I really love the HD graphics in this remake. It's really cool. So we need to walk across this bridge. And let's jump across these platforms to grab the rupees. Jump across! Ooh, that was close. There we go. What's this guy doing? I just saw a wild, a wild pig. Ooh, see, look, that black one there. Don't you see him? This is perfect. My wife was just telling me how she really wanted a pet. You ready to grab a link? Yeah, that's something we're going to do a little bit later. It's telling us how to pick up things. Yeah, that's like a snot-nosed guy like has like snot in his mouth. His nose is really gross. And before we go into the house, we, we need to crawl down here. Because there's a secret, secret we can find. Actually, like... For me, like, watching people, like, play this game for the first time, nobody would think to do this. But this is actually something. This is a chest. We have an orange rupee. 100 rupees. Wow, apparently we just stole our grandma's savings. How rude of us. It's for, it's for a greater cause. Sometimes you can, like, change, like, the... The view when you're crawling like this, but for some reason you can't hear. Anyways, let's climb up and enter ground Grandma's house. And nobody's here on this level. I'm sorry, Grandma, that I stole your your allowance or savings or whatever. I've been waiting for you, Link. Link, tr try these on. Time certainly flies. I can't believe you're already old enough to wear these clothes. And for some reason we got the hero's clothes. They look like they might be a little warm for this weather. Link's not all too happy about this. Don't look so disappointed, dear one. Just try them on. Today is the day we celebrate. It is the day that you become the age of, same age as the young hero spoken in all, of in all the legends. You only have to wear them for one day, so don't look so down. Be proud, child. In the olden days, this was the day the boys were finally considered to be men. They were taught the ways of the sword to prepare them for battle with their enemies. But we don't live in such an age any longer. Our ways are the ways of peace. Nowadays, I suppose Or Orca is the only one on the island who still knows anything about sword play. Hanging the family shield on the wall is as decoration is another tradition that has been carried down for, from those days. Does all this make sense to you? Link is not ha happy about wearing this. Isn't that nice, Link? They suited you perfectly. A perfect fit. Well, tonight I'm going to invite the whole town over for your birthday party, so I'd better get start getting ready, shouldn't I? I think this whole like house might not be a big enough room for everyone here. 
Grandma is going to make your favorite soup for you tonight. Mmm. I know you just know you're looking forward to it. Now go get your sister Ariel. Ariel, I, Ariel, I, I'm not sure how to pronounce the name, but anyways, let's leave our the house. Come on, leave. I haven't used a pro controller in like years, so the controls is kind of actually throwing me off. So we're actually gonna show myself like trying to catch a pig and. We need to do this so we can get some rupees. We need to throw the pig over here. And we're gonna find all these pigs. Yeah, yeah, I know about Z targeting. I don't need to know that. This is a black one. There we go. Let's take it over to the pen. This is definitely not required, but I'm just doing it. I'm just gonna tell you, you end up getting rupees for this, and because it, it's so, so it's really worth it. I think there's a pig all the way to the other side of here. But where? Yeah, yeah, get away from me. Where is the other pig? Uh, of course I fell. Yeah, you can't swim for too long. It's a crab, it's not a pig. Well, I guess I got all of them, I think. There's no pigs behind here. Oh, well anyways, let's just talk to the old lady for... Give me, like, give him the pigs. Why did you find these pigs and bring them here just for little me? Well, thank you, thank you so much. I've been thinking of getting a big pig for a while now. The boys will be so happy when they get home. Oh, Link, hold out your hand. This is your reward. Don't spend it all in one place. And you get a 20 rupees. This is our gratitude for bringing us now new family members. And another 20 rupees. And these little darlings are so adorable, I wouldn't mind having even more of them. No, I wouldn't mind one, one bit. Well, where is another pig? I thought there would be one where I thought they were, but... Oh, well, maybe they're in different places now in this remake. Oh, wait, is there one o over here? Behind this house? Yes, there is! Awesome! I'm just gonna waste time, like, carrying this pig all the way to the other side. And I need to try to not fall, because my controller is kind of awkward for some reason. It's just pr really old, so it's kind of hard to control. Like I said again, I haven't used this Pro Controller for like a long time. And throw! And looks like we're gonna get another 20 rupees for doing this. Yeah, yeah, now give me my 20 rupees. I guess I'd better think of names for these little onky wonkies, huh? Yeah, good luck with that. Anyways, now we just have- now we're gonna go to Ariel. Or Ariel, or whatever. Uh, get away from me! Let's be careful walking across this bridge. Yeah, climb up all the way on the ladder. Ah, hoy, big brother! Did Grandma make that offer for you? Oh wow, you look like you'd be way too too hot in the, those clothes. I guess they're pretty neat, though. So anyway, Link, 
And you close your eyes out, hold out your hand just for a second. I'm going to give you my most tre treasured belonging, but just for one day. Happy birthday! And we get a telescope, apparently. And it can be pretty useful. So, well, do you like it? I'm letting you borrow with a special gift just because you're my big brother. Aren't you lucky? Hee <laughs> hee. But why don't you try it out right now? Try looking at, over at our house from here. And we have to actually equip it, so let's set it to Y or X, I think. X or Y, I, I don't really care. I don't. Wait, let's, let's look at this post box. It's a weird-looking bird. Postman looks kind of weird, doesn't he? Ah, sky! Look, look, the sky! Look up in the sky! That's a huge bird. It has, it has someone captive. It's a pirate ship. This bird has some really epic dodging skills. Oh, said that too soon. Oh, the girl's falling! Link, this is so terrible! That girl fell into the forest! She needs help! But it's too dangerous for you to go there without something you can use to defend yourself with. Now it looks like we're gonna have to find something. Alright, here we go. So where we need to go now is over here. We need to go to this place where, like, the, uh, old, old man up there told us about the Z-targeting, like, tutorial and everything, but we need to go into this room. And let's talk to this old guy. Oh, what does it matter, Link? You have an urgent look about you. Has something happened? Whatever it is, from the look on your face, I su suspect it is no laughing matter. What say you, Link? Oh, uh, have you come for some serious instruction in the way of the sword? Yes, sir! Very good! Your first lesson shall be the horizontal slice. Face me and press B. Do not fear for my safety. I am ready for you. And just press B. Good, keep coming at me until you say very... Until you hear me say very good. Keep pressing B. Very good. Next is the vertical slice. Hold ZL and tar to target me and then press B. See? Keep swinging. Very good. Next is the thrust. Target with ZL and then tilt, tilt toward, for, control stick for, toward the me and press B. Come at me. Thrust with your, with your sword. Very good. C keep thrusting. Uh, sorry I broke your pot. Next is the spin attack. Hold B briefly to build up your strength and then release it. Or you can like rotate it, rotate it, but this is easier. Very good. More. Keep it up. You might want to like stay away from him while you like try to do the, B the, the spin attack. Next is harder. This is a parry attack. Target with ZL until you see the Flashing A icon, icon, and then quickly press A to perform a defensive strike. And there we go! Very good, and again, target with deal and watch for, closely for the flashing icon. Very good, now finally the jump attack. Draw your sword, target, and press A. Come at me, what's more? That was a fine display! And yet, I sense a certain anxiousness in the sword you hold. An eagerness that goes far beyond the mere desire to be wielded on the fields of battle. I do not know what has happened. 
but I have faith in you. Somehow I doubt you will misuse that, that sword. You may have it, Link. I give it freely. Take the blade with you. And we get we accept, accepted the hero sword. Alright. Since the olden days, the sword has been used to fend off evil. It is a blade but its blade is infused with the desire to become strong and righteous. Be strong, Link. Alright! Now we are able and ready to save that girl who fell into that huge forest. But first, I'm going to go over to this shop here, and technically I don't have to do it this now, but we have a lot of rupees, so I just want to get this over with. Inside. This is Beetle Shop. And let's buy a bait bag. We will be using this a lot, trust me. Thank you. It's actually even kind of annoying. You go and make a member's card just for you when you buy lots of things and build up your points, something good will happen to you. Something very good indeed. My shop is kind to its customers. No other shop will do this sort of thing for you. I'll have you know. I said at one point, said 30 points, yeah, yeah, at the end of different memberships. So let's buy these uh, all purpose bait. Thank you! Now we have two points saved up. Let's keep buying, buying these. Apparently we can't buy any more because we only have like five rupees. See, th those will come really useful later on. And now let's go! Onwards! Ah, fell in the water. Get away from me! Not nose guy. All right, you can actually get onto that, grab that ruby, but it's just one gr green ruby. I'm not. It's not worth it. I'll cut the, the branches and cut the grass to find more rubies, but there's hardly going to be any rubies in in those grass. Okay, now we have to carefully. Walk across this bridge. I'm nervous because of my controller. My controller's gonna be a problem later on, isn't it? It's the girl! It's the pirate girl! Okay, we can actually go, go through this, like, log and there's rupees inside of it. And there's our first enemy. And die! I was pressing A to roll. I, I'm not used to like this controller as you can tell. That was a pretty easy enemy. Put that big rock in the back of your mind for later, because we will be coming back here. Yep. Two more enemies! <laughs> Die! Yeah, Let's take this one out first. Let's get this one, Ruby. And she fell. Ouch! Wow, what's with that getup? Well, whatever, so where am I? Oh, that's right, the giant bird came in. Miss! Miss Chestra! Miss Tetra! 
Oh, thank you. Thank goodness you're safe. When I saw you get dropped on the summit, I thought you for sure you... Summit? So that bird dropped me on top of a mountain? Well, wasn't that nice of it. Well, don't just stand there. Let's go. Time to repair our debt to that bur bird in full. But miss, what about this boy? Don't worry about him. Come on. Of course, she won't address that we saved her, so... But whatever. I guess she wasn't awake when we fought those enemies, so technically she doesn't even know. Hi! Hoi, big brother! Oh no, watch out for that bird! And the bird stole the rill. Brother! A uh, stupid kid! Get a hold of yourself! She's gone! There's nothing you can do! What? You want to come with us on your on our ship? Do you understand what you're asking? We're pirates, you know. Pirates! The terror of the seas. What do we get on, out of bringing some helpless little kid along with us? I'll tell you what we get. A headache! I know how you must feel with your sister have been being kin been kidnapped and all, and all, but that doesn't really have anything to do with us now, does it? And how do you figure that? Oh, oh there, just who are you? Who do you? Where do you get off buddy on, on someone else's conversation? Please, all I mean to say is that if you big he bad pirates hadn't come to this quite little island, that poor girl, girl wouldn't have been snatched away by that bird. And just what do you mean by that? Just be quiet for a moment and I'll tell you. Now, as my work entails delivering letters, I spend much of my time traveling amongst the many different islands. As a result, I hear many things. Have any of you heard word that young Girls have been getting kidnapped lately from all regions of the Great Sea. No matter what, whether you've heard of it or not, that seems to be the case. Young girls with long ears like yours have been getting kidnapped, never to be seen again. And unless my eyes fail, fail me, the young girl who has just kidnapped from the island also has young, long ears, does she not? Much like you do, Miss Fearsome Pirate. My point is that the bird mistook that poor girl for you, and that's why it grabbed her. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe it was Link, Young Link who saved you from the monsters in the for forest, wasn't it? Is this true? Oh, and while I'm at it, I may as well tell you that the bird ki that kidnapped both you and Link's sister has made its foul nest to the north, on the heights of the, f the Forsaken for Fortress. The Forsaken Fortress? Isn't that the place where... So what are you going to do? Under the circumstances, I don't think it would be unreasonable for you to give li Link a little help now, would it? Hmm. I don't need you to tell me that. Even if I need were to consider it, lately I've heard nothing but evil rumors about the, this forsaken fortress. You can't possibly mean to go there with nothing but that cheap little sword. That's not brave. It's stupid. I mean, come on. Even a simple little island like this has to have something you can use as a shield, you know? Something to protect yourself with? Anything? I'll tell you what, if you could come back with something like, like that, we'll let, we'll let you stow away on our shell ship. Oh, and one more thing. Once we leave, you won't be coming back here for a while, so you better go say goodbye to your family while, while you have the chance. I don't want you get all getting all weepy and ho homesick on me. Uh, I guess we have to find some shield or whatever. And what we have to do is... Uh, actually, I want to cut this these logs and get this yellow ruby. I didn't mean to talk to you. Just go inside grandma's house. And we need to climb up the ladder first before talking to grandma and... Oh no, that sh the shield, well, shield that was there is gone! Link! Is this what you were looking for?
Take it with you. You got the hero shield. This is the legendary shield said to have been used by the hero himself. Yeah, yeah, I know hold I know how about using shields. I guess it is true. A real has really has been kidnapped, hasn't she? What kind of monster could take such a sweet young child? Yeah, it's sad music here, but we need we need to leave and go rescue here. Rescue her. Yep. Now we have everything we need and let's just go. But first, we have 30 more rubies, so I'm just gonna go to the shop just so I can buy one more all-purpose bait. Which actually. Well, we still can carry more. I just wanted to check. Oh, there we go. Bye. Now let's talk to the pirates and say that we're ready to leave. Well, that's a, that's a decrepit old, sh old shield. Are you sure you can still use that thing? Are you going to get splitters and cry? Well, whatever. If you're ready, Lynn, let's go. Are you ready? Yes. Good luck, Link! Good luck, luck finding Arrow! Take care of yourself! How long much longer is this going to go on, do you think? Do you have an estimate? Are you sure you shouldn't just quit right now? Seriously, just think about it. I can tell you're just going to get more sentimental from here on out. There's still time, you know. Are you sure we shouldn't just turn around and take you back to your island? Here we are on the pirate ship, and I was trying to think of her, the girl's name, and the, the name is actually Tetra. So, yeah, there's that, and we're actually gonna end off this episode here. So, in the next part, we will go uh, inside into the below the deck of the ship and uh, train with the I forgot his name, but train with like one of the pirates. So, yeah, we'll do that next time. So, if you like this part, be sure to subscribe to my channel, leave a like, and post a comment about what you thought of the video. Now, we'll see you guys next time for more of my Let's Play Four. The Legend of Zelda, the Wind Waker, HD. Have a wonderful day, guys, and peace out.